past 20 years, Hollywood has not outputted any new movie. It's just the same thing with a number beside it. We've had an expansion of Harry Potter universe with the Fantastic Beasts 1 and a second one coming along. We've had three new Star Wars, five Pirates of the Caribbean, six Transformer movies, that's counting Bumblebee, and let's not even talk about all the Disney remakes that they're making. This isn't a problem because Hollywood is an industry. The problem is that in this industry, it takes around 40 to 50 million dollars to market a movie, and that's just for the basic kind of Hollywood movie. Higher, higher budget ones tend to cost about double that. It's so much so that sometimes it's the advertisers that actually decides on what movie gets made and what doesn't. So why is this bad? Well, as I said, Hollywood is an industry. Movies are products. For example, you watch movies the same way you buy clothes. It's not original content, it's a brand. You're just buying the latest pair of sneakers. Now let me give you a bit of history. In 1950, there was a studio crisis right there in Hollywood. There were very few artists, and so the audience didn't feel compelled. The movies were shallow. This gave birth to the new Hollywood in the years 60 to 80 in which the author actually decided, rather than the advertiser. Hollywood is, well, as of today, alive and well, as we all know, and so this worked. Putting the artist in the heart of the project worked. And yet, the formula is still there. We still have brands, we still see the same movies, but there's hope. Let's take example of Mulan, sorry, to... 2020 this year actually, the budget was 200 million and it made in the box office a little short of 70 million. That's more than a hundred and thirty million dollars loss. So maybe it's time that Hollywood realizes that people are getting tired of their recycling. Maybe it's time they output actual new movies.